Hey everyone, welcome to this week's episode of Handy Mandy TV, and we're going to be continuing with our Christmas decor. So this time we're going to be doing a special vase. Now this is for the Christmas decor series, but the way we're going to be decorating it, you're actually going to be able to use it all year round. So what you're going to need is some um, white paint, and of course this is the Krylon stuff. This is four ninety seven for an aerosol that you just spray on. But I found that when I sprayed my pine cones from our previous decoration, the, um, the front porch planter, the link to all the Christmas decor will be below, um, it went on fairly, well it didn't go on as thick as I would like it, and so you would have to do multiple coats. So I'm actually going to take this Crafters Acrylic from the dollar store, this is a, two, or a little, like, little container tube for a dollar. And I'm going to take a big paintbrush and I'm just going to whack it on. And it's going to take no time at all. So, um, but before you paint, you will need painter's tape. Because if you want lights or a candle in here that isn't going to be as tall as the vase, you want it to shine through. But the paint is going to be uh, the undercoat because we're going to also put um, something else over top. And so you want little holes or little strips of light to get out. So we're going to choose a style or method to which these little strips of light will come out. So I will show you guys that. But the secret ingredient that we're putting... Ingredient, but like the secret ingredient, for lack of a better word, that we're going to be using is... Wait for it. Epsom salt? Who knew? Um, so you're going to need the vase, which is at the dollar store, or in case of Canada, it's Dollarama. So this is two dollars. The tube is a dollar. Paintbrush, just go to the paint aisle, grab a medium to large paintbrush for a buck or two. Um, um, if, for the decor, you can also buy an assortment of decor for a dollar to a dollar twenty-five, dollar fifty, um, which is what we have here. We have, I love these, these are the... The little apples on on a little branch together. It looks absolutely gorgeous. And the color is like a crimson, not like one of those cherry red, which doesn't match an apple. Um, the pine cones, I rummaged up from some pine trees from a previous decor. Um, I liked these. We have um, this super awesome uh, three-dimensional star that I'm going to be using for the New Year's Eve kind of look. Choose whatever you want. Um, if you're going for a certain color, like when I went there, there was not a lot of silver, to be honest. So um, what I did, however, is I grabbed the stuff that I did want in the shapes or styles or whatever that I want. And because I have Krylon Brilliant Silver um, Metallic Paint, I can actually just spray it the color I want. So if it's not silver, if it's gold or whatever color you want, you can buy it in the aerosol and just spray it the color you want. And as an added feature, you can go... So this was $4.97 at Walmart. This is at Walmart as well. This is the Elmer's Glitter. This is $3.97. So if you're putting the glitter on, you don't want to use glue because it's just going to take so much time to paint all those crevices. Use the Elmer Spray Adhesive. And this, I believe, is $6, $7, roughly. And it comes in such handy because if you have like presentations, you can spray on the back of the page and stick it onto your presentation board. You can use it for just about anything. So, um, you're going to need gloves when you're using spray on aerosol paint or glue because they do have warning labels that say uh, flammable, poison, and irritant. So, you want to keep your hands covered. Um, have some newspapers handy and a box to spray into. And I've used this so many times because I've done, you know, the series of Christmas decor. So, um, you're going to need some newspaper or flyers that are kicking around that are in recycling. Um, some other Christmas decor is the little size packages of the disco balls. And you're just going to need a couple cups to put your paint in. So, that's it. Um, now we're going to start on uh, decorating our vase with the little cutouts and then painting it.
Please don't Okay. 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 Okay.